Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm here today to review the market. I have not looked at the market in two weeks. This is my first look at a chart in two weeks. Long time for me to be away, but I needed the rest. I needed the vacation. I had an amazing time, and I'm back and ready to trade. Now, today is not a day to do anything. It's Columbus Day. The market will be slow today. There's probably very few gaps, if any. However, it's a nice, nice day to kind of regroup for me, get ready for the rest of the week. Earnings season starts, perfect time to be trading. Perfect time to be trading gaps, perfect time to be trading, period. And I'm very excited to be doing just that. Now, I'm looking here. Again, this is the first look I've had at charts in two weeks. And look at the market. This is the QQQs. It looks fabulous. Wow, this is, the, this is right before I left. So right before I left, the market came in here. Everyone was saying it was lower, except for me. I said we were higher. Look at what we did. This looks like this was on the second. On the second, the market had a big rally. Actually, we gapped down. Look, we gapped down on the day of October 2nd that we had the rally, and the gap down got bought, and we rallied three and a half dollars. Beautiful, and gapped up right after that, and we're holding, holding, holding. Market is higher. Market is absolutely higher. Wow, this is this is so terrific. So all along, I've been predicting the market would make another new high. Even when the market fell, 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 crashed, had the anomaly day, I predicted the market still would make another new high. Everyone thought the market was low, it was going to crash, and I said, no, this is amazing. This is beautiful. I love the knowledge that I have because if you didn't know what I know, you would never know the market was higher after this, after this, after this whole thing. And all of this in here kept confirming to me the strength of the market. And when, when this happened, I looked at it, I rated the gap. The market gap down the day that it fell like this, and I rated the gap, but it didn't rate per the system to short, and it was not a short. And in fact, I also said here, this is probably going to be the low of the year for 2015 and for a long time to come. I mean, it doesn't have to be, but I'm telling you, either way, the reality is the market's higher and is going to make another new high before the end of the calendar year, as I predicted. Now, will we get up over 120? The previous high, we, we could. I mean, it depends how big and fast and hard the rally comes in. It really depends on how quickly that takes hold. Right now, it's October, the middle of October. We still have a long time left for the end of the year. But it'll be very interesting to see. Either way, we will get on over this number before the end of the calendar year. Either way, this, is, this was an amazing call by me to even call the market would even do all of this after this. And the reason that I called it accurately and predicted that the market would continue hold rally and make a new high is because i read all the gaps i read the bearish gaps and the bullish gaps and i know how to read gaps and that is what enables me to predict what something's going to do on the live trading day in the gap as a day trade and also in the longer term in the market is something you just need to know how to do and and if you want to make money consistently because a lot of people a lot of people got creamed in here a lot of people are going to get creamed in here i mean this is the fact that I was able to predict this is really a credit to myself and the knowledge that I know and everybody that's taken my class knows this because you could have rated any of the gaps that the market did after all of this and you could have rated them for day trades or for the longer term and seen exactly what I saw. So market's doing just what I thought and the market has rallied every day since I left and it's, it's fantastic. It's absolutely fantastic. The market is higher. So I am back this week. Gonna get some good plays this week. And the market's going to rally this week, as predicted to, and continue higher and make another new high before the end of the calendar year 2015. This is Melissa Armo with the StockSwish.com. This is a market review of the QQQs. Nice rally the market's had in the last two weeks. It will continue now. It's showing its hand, which means who is in charge, and who is in charge is the bulls. And the fact that I knew who was in charge here when everyone said the market was going to collapse, I knew the bulls were still in charge here. And I knew this for many, many reasons. Number one was the gap rating system that I applied to the gap where I rated the gap and it didn't rate good enough to short. And then I knew it wasn't a short in the day. And it wasn't. And I knew it didn't break the chart, which it didn't. And also the swoosh, which happened in the morning. And so that's you know, all of those combinations of factors, which was an allowed me to predict everything that's happening right now, which is, which is turning out to be true. So have a great day, everyone. If you'd like any more information, I'm back. Email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com if you'd like more information on the upcoming classes. The next Golden Gap class is October 24th and 25th. Have a good weekend, everyone.